Hey there, Angie! It's time for us to spend some time with you today. And by that I mean a lot, a lot of time today. Angie, you have an interesting name. Eh? Huh? Really? Is my name so strange? Mm, I wouldn't say strange, but it is different. Surely isn't Japanese. No. No, not strange, really. Are you not from here? I... Angie lives with a tool on the Divine Island Paradise. No. Alright, but... Where is the island? What's it like? So divine! Yeah... I do remember you mentioning that when we first met, Angie. It's a divine... It's a divine island! It's a tiny divine island! It used to be much bigger. But I thought I used the natural disaster to make it smaller, because he thought it would look cuter. Uh... Ah? Uh? That was the reason? Um... I do have to wonder what the general opinion was about the new renovations on the island. With that natural disaster. Uh... My island has lots of plants and flowers too, you know. Oh. Hmm. Oh, is that so? Hmm. Oh, nice. Uh... But most of the plants and flowers on my island like to attack people. Wait, wait what? Huh? Did they attack people? <laughs> uh, you know, ever since my staying on Jebbawok Island, I never set foot on an island, like, ever again, nor will I ever want to. And it doesn't help that the second I would set foot on your island, Angie, I would get eaten. It doesn't really help, like, at all. I don't know, I don't know. Come to think of it, I'm honestly not sure if they actually plants or flowers. I do get the feeling that they are aliens, but I'm not quite sure yet. Huh? Well, what, what, what kind of island is this? Well then... What do you think, Shichi? What kind of place does my island sound like to you? She answered my question with a question. Come on, come on! If you get it right, Atula will bless you. I wish you divine luck. She hasn't given me any useful hints, so I just have to guess. <laughs> A tropical island. Uh, I don't know. Uh, can it be something more different? I don't want to be reminded of. I don't want to be reminded of Jabberwock Islands. Like maybe A Castle in the Sky. That's true. I love that movie. A Castle in the Sky. Ah. Yeah, but it got destroyed. I thought I prefers the crown anyway. Oh my god. Does Atua live on Earth? Oh me, oh my! Huh? Don't you know, Shuichi? Atua lives on the ground, you know. How is he supposed to stand if he's not on the ground? <laughs> Got me there, Angie. Hmm. But true. Um. So, where is your hometown, Angie? So divine! In the middle of the ocean, surrounded by water and nothing else. A solitary island somewhere far out to sea. But, but... But I get deep sea deliveries all the time. Deep sea deliveries? What the world is that? Huh? Deep sea. As in submarines? Yup, yup. Deep sea is a shipping website. They have all kinds of stuff. It's super convenient. Oh. Ooh. Like... Hmm. I bet it has, like, nice prices and discounts. I mean, you surely must have gathered a lot of points up until now, Angie. You surely must must get, like, super discounts by now. Uh, oh, that's what you meant. Yoo-hoo! I don't know what you thought I meant, I meant but I use Deep Sea all the time. Maybe Deep Sea is an instru instrument of Atua, because it made life on my island a divine experience. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> Atua works in mysterious ways, I suppose. Of course, of course! Deep Sea is how I got new is issues of my favorite magazines. Uh, and food, clothing, organ meat, how divine. plus medicine, blood, and even children. The ch children? <laughs> what? Wait. Wait. Uh, are you serious? Some of that stuff is a little crazy. <laughs> children! Why the world does it also deliver children? Huh? Mm -hmm. How so? If it can be shipped, then Deep Sea definitely stocks it. Well, well, yeah, but seriously, children? But, but... Now if they just stocked offerings and oopars, that would be so divine. The... Oop! 
parts. Oh no, Angie. <laughs> Not you too. You are into that sort of stuff too? What exactly goes on on Angie's Island? <laughs> uh, I don't know, I... I uh, but I don't think I am prepared for whatever in the name of Atu um, is happening on that, on that island. This is just way too much for me. <laughs> And I bet that it's gonna be even more wild. I mean, I have been to a kingdom where kids can already drive tanks. Can Angie's Island top that? I don't know. Hey, hey, Shinji, I need your help with something. Hey, it would seem Angie needs help. Let's see what we can do, Shinji. Okay. I'd be happy to help. Woohoo! Hey, thank you. Madden, I wanted to have me look for something. Okay. Leave it to me. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. What are you looking for? A uh, yep. A sickle. A uh, sickle? Huh? A uh, sickle? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, a sickle. You know, crescent-shaped blade, one handle, cut stuff easily. Uh, um. Yeah, I, I, I think we got it, Sanji. But why in the world do you need a sickle? <laughs> is this is this some art thing you want to work on? What are you going to do with that? Mow the lawn? That's not right! <laughs> no, silly. I'm gonna step it into my window. Why? Huh? The window? Uh, yep. On my island. If you feel sad and lonely at night, just have a sickle into your window. Oh. Uh, you feeling sad, Angie? Oh. Uh, maybe a hug will help you feel better. If you're feeling sad. That's an odd custom. And then? Anyone who sees it can't just ignore it. They gotta go consult a person. They gotta do anything they can't consult them. And I do mean anything. Anything? That's frightening. <laughs> so when am I feeling sad? I'm gonna have a sickle ready. You're right. I see. Well, if you ever need anything else... Uh... Anything else? Hmm... Nothing else comes to mind. How divine! That's a nice shady. I barely can console when I stab my sick. <laughs> yep. When the time comes, you won't have to worry, Angie. We will make you feel happy again. Huh? Huh? But me? <laughs> yeah, man, I mean... Pfft. It's just, it's just a sickle in the window. Nothing ominous about that. As long as there is a cute girl behind that broken window, you bet your ass you're gonna try your best to console her. Yaha! I wanna be consoled by you. <laughs> hmm. I, I see. Oh yeah! I'll teach you all of my island's customs, Shichi. You can't do that. First, you're not allowed to feed children after midnight. Why would we be feeding children in the first place? Also, why is that the first custom that you're telling us? I've heard of a creature like that somewhere before. A creature? Come on, come on! Because it's unhealthy. They won't grow up to be sta stable adults. Oh, alright. Alright, that sounds reasonable. And then? And they have to undergo a divine initiation ritual before they can enter adulthood. A ritual? Like a coming of age ceremony? Mm, I guess so. So divine! During the ritual, we perform intense physical workouts. They all become adults at the same time and feel all happy and relaxed afterwards. Huh? Uh, what? Eh? How divine! I haven't undergone my ritual yet, but I had a divine experience. Hmm. I see. Happy and relaxed, huh? Uh, wait, 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 are you talking about sex? Of course, of course! That's right! On my island, everyone shares this, you shares in our fun. Happy times! <laughs> Happy times? <laughs> what? At weddings, for example, after the bride and groom consummate their vows. Cons consummate you? What? The guests make their own vows, and then they consummate those too. The guests too? What? Everyone? 
Thanks, be to Atua. After a successful consummation, the bride is blessed with a baby. Uh, I don't think I, I don't really like how you use that word consummation there. <laughs> also, what did you just say there? Uh, okay, he's blessed with a baby. Of course, we all share the baby too. Oh my, what? Using a sickle. What? Sickles? Babies? What do you mean sharing a, what do you mean sharing the baby with a sickle? Huh? What the hell are you going to do with that? <laughs> <laughs> just kidding, we can share a baby. But we can definitely use a sickle. We just share the bride. Um... Huh? What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know what to believe in anymore! <laughs> this island has a ton of strange traditions. Yeah. Oh, good lord. Angie was making burst chokes, burst chokes against the canvas, accentuating each with a sexy moan. She looked like a womb possessed, as if being puppeted. Yeah, she she has now turned into a vessel for Atua, I'm pretty sure. Jeez. Jeez. Mm. Uh, um... Angie? Huh? Shichi? Are you uh, okay? Are you okay? You look like you were hypnotized or something. I was worried. Atua! <laughs> Atua! <laughs> I'm okay. Atua came down from the heavens and filled me with his holy... His holy presence. All my work is created in this manner. What a yeah, surprise! You did say that before. But I'm surprised. Atua usually doesn't come down in front of others, you know. Maybe Atua revealed himself because you're a chosen one? Hmm? Maybe a... Okay, let me just uh, read it again. Maybe a Atua revealed himself because you're a chosen one, huh? Hmm, a chosen one? I don't know about that one. I was chosen. Hey, hey, Shichi, look at this picture. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. I cautiously glanced at the painting Angie had just finished. Whoa! Shichi? What's wrong? You look like you see a ghost or something. Uh, uh. In an instant, I felt my consciousness slip away, like a candle blown out, of, out by the wind. Sorry, I felt like I lost consciousness for a minute. Uh, can't say that I'm sure. <laughs> can't say that I'm surprised. Atua sure, Atua sure has immense power. It'll be okay. It's okay. I don't mind. This sort of thing happens every now and then. It happens every now and then, does it? <laughs> um. Nah, art sure is difficult to understand. Hmm. Yep. <laughs> that's what everyone else says too. Well, gee, I'm not that surprised. Even so, you felt it with such intensity that you fainted. But you're okay now, right? Yeah! Yeah, <laughs> I'm so happy. But, but... Still, it's rather strange that you fainted when Atua chose you. Um... What exactly does chosen mean? How divine! It means you were chosen! For what? Well, yeah... I see, I see! Still, I think you're somewhat, you're somewhat lacking. You're not quite divine enough. Matua agrees too. Uh, um... Not divine enough? Cause Atua is watching over us! Very well. By Atua's divine decree, your training begins today. Grinning year to year, and just skipped over to me and... Ah! Uh. Uh. 
Wait, wait, what are you doing? Oh, me, oh my. Huh? Why are you running, sweetie? No. Y you grabbed me all of a sudden. And you tried to take off my clothes. Uh, clothes? <laughs> Angie? Uh, yep. Of course. Who else would I provide what you're lacking? Uh, Angie! Uh, I, don't, I don't think that this is the right moment. Or even the right thing to do. At least to save it for the love hotel, but not here. It'll be okay. I, I think I'm okay. Thanks anyway. Cause Atua says so. What do you think? I know. Atua and I will gently embrace you. Hey! But, what does that mean? What are you going to do? Huh? Huh? Wait! I just wanted to talk, Angie. Just be friends. Trichi. Uh, s s sorry for yelling. I I just um. But I'm just I'm just worried about you, Angie. Ah, uh, Angie. What? Why? Oh, no, oh, Angie. Wait. She is mad at us, isn't she? And you took off in a sprint, and I couldn't catch her. This is bad. And then she's really mad at me. Uh, yeah, we're definitely gonna have to apologize to her, Shuichi. I mean, even if she was about to do something that we didn't want, yelling doesn't solve anything here. I know I yelled at Angie the other day. But I wasn't mad at her. And I need to apologize. She probably turned me down, but... Yeah! <laughs> I wonder what we get up today. I wonder what, I wonder what we get up to today, Shinji. Uh... Okay, I guess she's not mad at... I guess she's not mad. Or sad anymore. Uh, I thought she would be too mad to even speak to me, but she's not acting any different. Alright, time to apologize. Sorry. Angie, I'm sorry that I yelled at you before. Why? Why? Huh? Why are you apologizing? It'll be okay. I'm over what happened. Even Atua forgives you. Huh? Uh, Atua did. Of course, of course! Yep! Uh, um... But what about you, Angie? Are you... are you mad at me? Why? My feelings don't matter. And the one has forgiven you, so it's fine. No. Your feelings do matter, Angie. I wanna know if you were mad or anything. And... If you are apologizing. Hey, Angie. What is Atua? Atua! Atua is God! And God is Atua! He's always with Angie! Fine. No. You're right, but... What? Hmm? Do you want to know more about that trash, Angie? It's okay. I'll teach you. But not you, okay? Smiling even wider than usual, Angie... ...settled up to me. And I spoke in a low whisper. Uh... The truth is, my work are to find messages from Atul. Huh? Uh, it's not that surprising. Divine messages. Yup, yup. It's an oracle. Mm. It's an oracle. Only I can receive Atua's divine messages. An oracle? She definitely does look possessed when she's making her art. Could it be... I... That's why it's my duty to tell everyone on my island about Atua's teachings. Atua's words are absolute, so everyone listens to anything I say. Huh? Anything? Of course, of course! Anything! One time, Atua suddenly told me to throw a big festival. Everyone, everyone on the island attended, and we partied all week long. All week? And then? It was so much fun, but since no one worked for a week, it kind of messed up our lives. But, but... But Atua told me to do it, so that's that. Atua gets lonely pretty easily. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't think so. I think Angie is the, only, the lonely one. Angie believes that Atua's will is her will. 
That means that everyone will listen to her. And that means that Atua will take care of everything. But that's not right. Hmm. Yoo-hoo! Hey, hey, Shinji. What's up? What you thinking? Uh. Ah! <laughs> too, too close. Because? Because I wanted to focus on me. Well, I can see myself in your eyes. Wait! Wait, Angie, pack up a little. Why? What? Why? Why? Why, why, why? Uh, um... What do you mean, why? You're really close to me, and... So divine! I don't mind. I want to be closer to you. <laughs> there, now you're closer to me. Hmm, I don't mean... I don't mind being emotionally closer to you, but can you scoot back a little bit? Oh. You don't mind being emotionally closer to her. Yeah, just said that, eh, Shrichi? <laughs> yeah, now now they are touching faces. Yay! I wish Shrichi again. Happy, happy me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, happy. I'm just being pretty happy lately. I wonder why. You're still wondering why, Mr. Saihara? Yoo-hoo! Hey, hey, Shichi, guess what? I got a present for you today. Angie pulled out what looked like a small board covered in fabric. Come on, come on! Here, Shichi, we're at the clock, okay? Slowly, gently. Um, okay. I hope it doesn't have anything to do with the initiation ritual we talked about before. I ran the clock carefully, just as she said. I saw a canvas about the size of my palm, and on that canvas... Hmm. You make this, right, Angie? What's it of? Oh, me, oh my! Huh? You don't recognize it? It's your face, silly! His face? Huh? This is me? Oh, And you made a canvas of you, Shuichi. Not only does it not look like me, it doesn't even look human. It's the thought that counts, Shuichi. Here! Yep, I wanted to have it. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You don't faint when you see my pictures anymore. Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy I've gotten closer with you. Hmm. Not gonna mention it, that is true. Perhaps I've just gotten used to it. That's not right! No, Shuichi. You are chosen by a Tua. And now you're ready to be Angie's husband. Isn't it husband? <laughs> oh God! Uh, husband? Huh? Husband? Where did this come from? Oh boy, what have we gotten ourselves into? Atua has spoken. What the fuck are you talking about? We, we we can talk about that sort of stuff, like being husband and all that. Jeez, this reminds me of that. This reminds me of uh, Mikan's ending. In island mode, when we decide to just <laughs> to to just become married and all that. Atua has spoken. Shichi can be with Angie forever. Hey Angie, does Atua decide everything for you? Even your own husband? Ah. Uh, hmm, well, the truth is, maybe I want you to be my husband. Whoa! And Atua has nothing to say about that? Those are your feelings, Angie? Huh? What? Because. Because I really do want to be with you forever. Does this mean I chose you, not Atua? Uh. Are you actually confessing your love? Uh, um. You confessing your love? Huh? Confession? No. Uh, yeah, because you clearly like me and all. Oh, I see, I see. Is that all? You just want to know if I like you too? Okay, I do. There, it's decided. Wait! B b b but choosing a husband is an important decision. You need to think about it more. Why? And why do you pick me? I'm just an ordinary guy compared to you. 
No, no. But you're not ordinary. My first time was with you. Yeah. First time? But we... But, but we didn't even get to your love hotel scene yet. Huh? Wait, what do you mean, first time? Uh... Shuichi, did you secretly have Whoopi with Angie while I was not looking? I mean, Jesus Christ. I... You're the first one to ever get angry at me. Eh, what? Since that moment, I haven't been able to stop thinking about you. I just think about you all the time. Huh. Well, I see. I suppose Angie never got scolded before. After all, on her home island, her words were the words of Atua. Of course, if Angie admits that she got mad at me, that must mean that those are her genuine feelings, not Atua. Wow. <laughs> I feel quite surprised. Yeah, those are her genuine feelings. Well, we did it, Chichi. We actually got Angie to reveal some of her own feelings. And that comes from your and that comes from you yelling at a girl. <laughs> How life works sometimes. That's good. It's a little strange, but there is definitely a bond between us now. Of course. There's still the matter of Hey Shuichi! Will you be my husband and stay with me forever? Uh <laughs> we aren't that close yet. I can't be your husband. Well, you got no choice there, buddy. Your friendship has been deepened. Huh. Wow. You've learned a new skill. Atua's intuition. Huh. Sweet deal. I somehow dodged Angie's proposal. Now we got Angie's undergarments. Our first undergarments, Shuichi! Alright! And to think that we got to this point where Angie wants him wants him to be her husband. I mean, we still got like 14 more love hotel scenes to go through. And God knows how many girls we're gonna end up with by the end of their free time events. It's just... Eh, I mean, what can we do? Uh, we don't have a choice. If we do end up with every single girl, then might as well have fun while we're at it. <laughs> Of course, Angie is all up to you, Shuichi. I don't think I can help with that. Uh, I can help you that much with her. I think I'm just gonna go and talk to the other people while you're busy with her. Kidumi, here you go. Hi, though, my love. <laughs> 